Good afternoon from the CBS 19 newsroom. I'm Jillian Sheridan. And I'm Justin Early. An East Texas child is stable but in unknown condition at a Dallas hospital after being shot yesterday in Henderson County. The sheriff's office says it looks like the 11-year-old was accidentally shot by another child who lives in the home in the Crossroads community. Child Protective Services is now investigating as well. Gun deaths involving children could be happening more often than reported. Federal data shows about six children die a year from unintentional shootings. But a group called Every Town for Gun Safety contends it's more like 100 because some deaths are classified as homicides or suicides and don't take into account the fact that guns were involved. East Texas experts show you how to protect your children tonight. Well, some new Walmart stores have opened in East Texas recently, and there's another local city to add to the list, but some people aren't happy about it. Why people in Frankston have issues with the new retail presence tonight. Well, you're about to see a lot more state troopers around, including here in East Texas. They're increasing patrols in time for the July 4th holiday weekend. We'll show you where they are focusing their attention and what they're looking for tonight. Special Health Resources of East Texas says only one in seven people with HIV actually know they have it. It's joining another health clinic for a fun way to get people tested for the disease tomorrow in Longview. All about kicking for a cause coming up tonight. It's coming up along with weather and sports on KYTX, CBS 19 News at 5 and 6, the latest anytime online at CBS19.tv.